All right, top on this vintage ass chair. Hope it holds me. All right, it's gonna hold. What's up everybody? So today we are doing a couple of science experiments. All these experiments involve color. So food coloring is really the only common ground between them all, so if you get some food coloring, you're good. This is kind of like a craft with Dan, but also experimenting with Dan. Experimenting with Dan, it's like an adult film. <laughs> What's up, baby? We're experimenting with Dan. So the first thing I'm gonna teach you is, you ready? Oh. How to make a homemade lava lamp. And I know what you're thinking, you're probably like, why? Chicks love lava lamps. No, scratch that. Who wrote, did you write that, man? What, what girl do you know of likes lava lamps? What is this, the 70s? New, new take, redo it, yeah. The reason why we're doing lava lamps today is because lava lamps are kind of expensive. They're like 50 bucks. Hell no, I sound like some cheap bastard now. What are you? Last time, man, if this isn't it, you're done. So today we're making lava lamps because they're fun. Oh, you little mother Get off the teleprompter now. So first thing you're gonna need is you're gonna need a vase. Unfortunately for me, there are some roses in this vase, so I gotta take them out. This vase is kinda like, like the fat little brother of this one. <laughs> no spiders, I swear to God, there's any spiders. Smooth. So the things you're gonna need for this craft is some olive oil or vegetable oil, food coloring, and some antacids and pain relief. So Alka-Seltzer. So once you have your vase, what you're gonna wanna do is fill up water to about here. 10% of it with water. Very little amount. All right. Wow. Okay, that's, thank God I'm not a bartender. Holy shit. that was terrible. Maybe, a, yeah, that's good. I swear I'm not making this up. <laughs> now I spilled a little bit of the water just to show you that I am in fact not perfect. So. Next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take some of your food coloring and you're gonna dye the water down below. Give it a couple drops. You're gonna take your vegetable oil or olive oil and you're gonna fill it almost to the top. The water and the oil will actually separate. The water will stay at the bottom and the oil will sit above the water. So you need to wait till all the bubbles kinda like Settle down. We got time. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take one of your elk seltzers or antacids and you're gonna drop it in and watch what happens. Please work, please work, please work. Woo! Lava lamp. So what it's doing is it's getting dissolved by the water down below and it's bringing up the gases from the bottom which are then creating these bubbles which is like a lava lamp. I'll drop the rest in. So it's pretty good for homemade. It's not a waste. Okay, I know when I poured that in, everyone's like, oh my god, man, that's such a waste of oil. It's not, you can reuse it many, many times. Okay, so for this next one, what you're gonna need is a little plate. You're gonna need some whole milk or 2% milk, any milk that has high content of fat in it. Dish soap, cotton swabs, and some food coloring. Now take your milk, your whole milk, 2% milk, and you wanna just fill the plate. Of course. This is some bubbly ass milk. Once you have the milk settled, you're gonna take your food coloring and you're gonna drop in the middle just a couple drops. You're gonna take your cotton swabs and you're gonna put, you're just gonna dab it in the soap. You're gonna just go and you're gonna touch the middle of it with the soap and watch what happens. If you just leave it there, it's gonna constantly go. It's pretty sweet. Here we go. Whoa! That's a good one. So there you guys have it. That was a couple of experiments that I actually thought were super cool. I found a whole bunch, but those are probably the coolest ones. 
I suggest you steal these and you use them for science projects or whatever and get really awesome grades. So thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe if you haven't yet. There's a little button, a little gold or red button you can click. I believe it's red now. I have new videos coming out every single Wednesday. Um, so come back, check back here Wednesday, and I should have some new stuff for you. So thanks a lot for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. See you guys later.